good morning. Lyrics, we get lyrics. They keep coming in the mail from those who long to hear their song sung by the great voice. So, okay, the latest come from listener David Moulter, who writes for the Cranberry Review Journal, a weekly that circulates in the northern suburbs. Moulter tries to let on that the only reason he wants us to sing his lyrics is that he can put his radio on a windowsill and chase some unwelcome pigeons who have been camping on his roof. But anyhow, he's addressed himself to the ongoing saga that finds the Eddies de Bartolo so far refusing to cough up the kind of fatso new contract that will make Penguin star Mario Lemieux happy. And inasmuch as Eddie Sr. recently was ranked by Fortune magazine as the 21st richest man in the country, Moulter sees him as the chintzy villain. What with the Penguin's home ice lying in the Lower Hill District, Moulter entitles his song The Lower Hill Billies, or The Ballad of Mr. D. Should the great voice sing it? Okay, we'll sing it. Come and listen to my story about a man named Ed A poor businessman with his franchise in the red And then one day he was feeling kind of blue When up through the draft come the center of you Mario, that is the next best game Set a spell, take your shoes off well, the first thing you know, old Ed's a billionaire. The kinfolk said, Ed, move away from there. Said, Ed, the ego isn't where you ought to be. Because they only like the Steelers and the Pirate family. Champs at his Super Bowl World Series. Set a spell. Take your shoes off. But Pittsburgh couldn't say goodbye to Ed and all his kin. The ticket prices rose, but fans just kept on flocking in. The muse who made the Stanley Cup a possibility by wrapping up the scoring race and then the MVP. A race was due for Mario, but Mr. D said no. We'd like to pay him more, but we just haven't got the dough. But then the fortune listing brought him in at 21, a billion and a half to split the father and the son. So let us send a message out to both the Yeti D's. Reach down into your pockets and produce a few more cheese. Now let them you leave Pittsburgh because he lacks a just reward. It's the only thing on planet Earth you really can't afford. Y'all come back now here. The great voice has sung again. This is Myron Cope on sports.